Record to beat? Well, there's no record to beat. My fastest rando so far has been 220, but that was with no boss key skips and I think seven dungeon or no, I think it was eight dungeon rewards, but still it was no boss key skips and easier setting, easier slash faster settings. And yeah, also I have um, boss entrance randomizer turned on this time, so I won't know what boss at the end of what dungeon. Yeah, I think I've been getting faster at random in general for the most part. Sometimes I be dumb. Random boss entrances means I go into the boss room in Deku Tree and I could find Twin Rova or some other boss. No, I'm not gonna boss key skip just to see what the boss is. Okay, I'm gonna start now. Starting in a shop. What are. is this. okay, it's a regular stick. Okay. Nothing in there, but it does have both sticks and nuts. Highland shield, iron boots. 110 rupees, can't buy it. Fire arrows. Uh, Decker shield, 75. Um, I can't buy that. Uh, I can actually buy that shield, hold on. I should have should have done this earlier. There's a 20 rupee in the crate over here. I should have just got it immediately when I c came out of Hyrule Castle. Dumb of me not to. 30 skulls sun song. What is that? Minuet. Choose. But I need choose to get it. What is DC? Ice cavern. Let's see where safe warp goes. Nice. Very nice. Water's Fire Temple. <laughs> the double wallet. Nice. You know what? Before I even check Curie Shop, this is just straight up the optimal thing to do. Is go kill some kids. Skull kids, of course. Wait, are they here at daytime? They are, right? He's gonna kill me, dude. Alright. So check Kakiri shop, uh, go back to child. Actually, I should probably go back to Kak and get that. There's nothing here, dude. Is that a stick? Of no. It's hoping for stick capacity. Dude, I'm gonna die. Deku's shadow. Yeah, I somehow found the double wallet super quickly. So I can buy iron boots immediately. Uh, Fires and Goron Tunic are in the night shop and I don't have sun, so I can't get it right now, but I'll most likely make a second trip to child anyway. Where do I want to go? Maybe I'll go to Gerudo Valley first, actually. Yeah, Gerudo Valley, Lake Hylia, might be good. Do you guys like the sounds? I serve. There you go. Are you happy now, chat? I got three blue items. I got ice, ice trap, and blue rupee. Uh, do I want to go to Hyrule Field or Zora's Domain? I think Domain is better. Yeah, because I can check Jabu. Zora Shop, anything good? Hookshot. Real? One... <laughs> Alright, I'll come back in just a second. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm gonna check Zora's Fountain first. Uh, because I have to come back down again afterwards anyway. And then I'll buy Hookshot when I come back down. Jabu is GTG. Can I do anything here? I can do one check. Uh, I can do two checks actually. Let me just do this real quick. Yeah, I actually don't mind um, using keys in this situation because Child is going to be able to vine clip through a bunch of these with explosives later anyway. 
Oh, now I'm not gonna have enough rupees for Bean Guy. I might, well, I might find rupees in Zora's River. Did I make it in time for Dampe? I don't think so. Probably not. No, the moon's way too high. I think. Oh, forest boss key. There's one boss key. We go on sword, nice. Spirit. Uh, I can do a little bit. No, I can't really. No, I was in the same position the other day, and I realized it was a bad idea. Sorry, song. Almost right where it'd be useful if I had an ocarina or a bottle. Okay, that was kind of dumb. I'm just gonna grab fire arrows and then go adult. So I'm probably gonna do Ice Cavern right after this too, because I can do Reverse Ice Cavern. Oh, I didn't get this chest, did I? Well, I can get it with shoes in a sec anyway, so I don't have to clip in. That is the most evil ice trap I've ever gotten. This whole time I was so excited. Bomb shoes, bomb shoes, I can get bomb shoes real quick. Nope. Yeah, that throws off everything. That throws off my whole plan. Well, I'm gonna go to Ice Cavern. Um, I, even without bombs, uh, since I can do Reverse Ice Cavern, I can check pretty much all of Ice Cavern really quickly. Wait a second, how do I get past this red ice? Uh... I actually don't know. Can I hookshot the freezers above? Dude, uh... Dude, give me magic, come on. Uh, I can't lure them over here, can I? I guess I can do forward ice cavern for most stuff. I can still skip the silver rupee puzzle at the end at least. Man, I was thinking that ice cavern was gonna be super quick and easy. Wait, why am I doing that? Um, this is gonna be annoying. I also don't want to kill the keys because I need them to damage boost over here. To damage boost into the- wait. Do they lose their ice or not? Oh no, they don't. Uh, can I even- <laughs> I don't know if I can actually do this. Uh, whatever, I guess. Alright, Ice Cavern was not a good decision without explosives. Okay, whatever. Just leave. Uh, oh, you know what? I want to check Forest Temple. I accidentally turned off my Wii <laughs> instead of reset. A uh, huge honk. It really depends on the trick. There are some tricks that are not very precise, and you can kind of just eyeball it without being too precise. And there are some tricks that require extreme precision, and it's really a case by case basis. Okay, water with iron boots I can actually do a decent amount. Nice. Water boss key. Convenient. That's two boss keys. Okay, so this was forest. So forest is water. Man, where are my items? This seed is not great. I need to find forest temple because I can go... I can beat forest temple already. Well, I can check the boss room of forest, I guess. I've pretty much found all the bad dungeons. Like, I still need to find DC, DC, Deku, Forest, and what's the other one I'm missing? Nice. Be troopy. Why does this fit Flare Dancer so well? If I let Flare Dancer run around the room, it fits so well. Choose, um, yeah, I have to accept that, so no save scum. Pretty 
Prelude. Still nothing to play songs with. Thanks, Arisa Bewildebeast. Javu, uh, I can check a handful of stuff here. Bomb bag, worth, definitely worth to come into Javu. Spirit Bosky, that's three Boskies. Nice. Okay, so I have boss rando on, or boss entrances randomized, so let's see what's in here. Phantom Ganon. I can be Phantom Ganon. Chabu swallowed a whole art gallery, yeah. Skull Soul Token. DC, nice. Do I think they will ever remake OOT? No, that would never happen. They would never remake this game and put it on a different console and make it a handheld. No, I like OG 3D. I am not an OT 3D hater. I just thought the question of will they ever remake OT was funny. I mean, I assume the question is will they remake it again with like new engine or something like FF7 style remake, I assume. And the answer to that is no, of course not. Uh, there's one Skull Club that is only intended for Adult Link to get. Uh, Child Link can get it using something kind of dumb. Uh, just say Warp Out, yeah. Alright, so DC is Volvagia. Uh, so I could check what the Water Temple boss is right now. Yeah, I might as well do that. Goma, nice. My most treasured gaming memorabilia. I have, like, no gaming memorabilia. I think the closest thing to gaming memorabilia I have is Metroid Dread Special Edition. I have that. <laughs> That's like it. It made it daytime, dude. <laughs> yeah, I guess my many copies of OOT. Oh, we duel. Yeah, maybe we duel. If Maybe that counts. We duel is rare memorabilia now. How many copies of OOT do I have? English 1.0, English 1.1, English 1.2, Japanese 1.0, WeVC, English WeVC, Japanese WeVC, uh, English Collector's Edition, Japanese Collector's Edition, English Master Quest, Japanese Master Quest, Switch, I guess, if that counts in Wii U. No, no PAL copies. Anti PAL. No. Dude, you idiot, please. <laughs> Magic. Long shot. Double magic. Both magics in Death Mountain. Alright, fire is Deku. Wait, do I, I have fire arrows, right? I don't have bow. Alright, what's gonna be the boss? Okay, I can do Morpho. Yeah, if there's a boss I couldn't defeat, I'd have to warp out. Like, I know, um... Uh, DC, the boss of DC is Volagia, and I don't have hammer, so I couldn't beat DC yet. Bolero. Nice. It'd be nicer if I could play it. Every song before Ocarina, yeah. At this rate. <laughs> nice. Uh, I can already tell Ganon's Castle is going to give me nothing. It's either going to give me nothing or be loaded. Okay, I know Gold Gauntlets is junk, so I don't even need to bother checking it. Wow, Ganon's Castle really is completely junk. Literally nothing, unless Bosky Chest is something good. 
Bomb bag. So I got an extra bomb bag. That's the only thing in all of Ganon's castle. I mean, it's nice. It's convenient. I don't know if it's worth checking all of Ganon's castle for. Really? That's unusual. I don't know what to do about QPA, dude. Like, I can't make a setup that works everywhere. And... Finally a bottle. And then, like, it's hard to tell what frame I'm gonna fall off the ledge if I just eyeball it. And then it just leads to failing it forever. Can I freeze the spikes? Yeah. Yeah, QPA has both fire- it both has Din's fire and ice arrow power. So it can freeze the spikes. Opponent song. Ah, oh, but I, but I got a bottle. Oh, also another power of QPA is it also is the strongest damage in the game and does ten damage on uh, Iron Knuckles. No, you can't use this blue fire rose. At least I don't think so. Hover boots worth. All right, things are finally starting to look up. Bow, spirit loaded. I can't get either of the checks up here, but I can use this as a way to get back down to the main room with while using a necessary key and not an unnecessary key. Because getting up here, there's no way without a key, but getting down to the main room, I can get down to without a key using a strat that I think some of you guys like. Oh no. Legitimate strat. Dang. Can't be Baronade, so I gotta leave. No, y well you can QPA on Baronade, it can't kill Baronade. It can do damage, but it can't kill. Okay, I guess I'll run into Ice Cavern real quick and just grab the um... Grab that one check I had to skip real quick. It's a check that takes probably less than a minute. Maybe not real quick, but relatively quick. Uh, I did not mean to do that. I thought I had big one sword equipped. Nice. Okay, maybe this is gonna be slow. Why has Ice Cavern been the one that's been so bad this seed? It was nothing. Scale. It's Coconut Mall. Burrows win, nice. Alright, I can beat Shadow now. Oh wait, no, I, I don't have Shadow Boski, do I? Wait, maybe I do. No. Shadow and Fire I don't have. Okay, so I know Ice Cavern has to be Forest Temple. Alright, if this is any boss besides Twin Rova, I can beat it. But if it's Twin Rova... Okay, nice. I think I should go back in and clear Forest. Yeah, I can, I can do it with two keys. What? No, I wanted it crushed. <laughs> Forgot the space next to it was open. I just realized I still have no strength. No strength in almost three hours is crazy. This song is terrible after you listen to it for a really long time. Extended periods of time listening to this is torture. Like it's good, it's good for the length that you hear it in the mini game. And then if you just continually listen to it forever, it just is like, oh my God, please stop. Oh, I just remembered, I never got the skull in the main room. I gotta make sure to get that. Oh, I might as well get that. Oh, speaking of strength. And slingshot.
Uh, I'm bad. Lullaby. Still no ocarina though. I got I got a bottle so I can play songs, but we'll see if I can get all songs before an ocarina. Uh, okay. I'm I'm gonna save scum, but I might come back for that. That's annoying, actually. Serenade. Uh, this is gonna this is gonna be awkward for. Well, actually, wait. How many keys do I have? Uh, okay. So actually, my fifty skull reward is um is a water temple key. So actually, I can just go grab fifty skulls, or I I'll probably grab one more skulltula around here, and then I can just grab um fifty skull reward, and so I can have both serenade and. Gaunts. Storms, okay. Okay, so I'm gonna leave the silver gaunts behind for now. Um, I'm probably gonna get a skull to very soon. Then I'll go back to, actually I'm gonna go to Shadow anyway. Shadow, which is Deku. All I'm missing is Requiem and Time. I'm 10 out of 12 of, of songs before Ocarina. Boomerang, uh, that's potentially bad. Well, not necessarily. I am gonna have to save here before using my next key. Okay, no, this is fine, but if I find another item in the other deeper part of Shadow, then it's gonna be really weird. All right, I do not need to go back to Water Temple. Save's coming, good. No, dude. Lens. Uh, what am I doing? No, what am I doing? <sighs> Whatever. I wanted to OI with that so that I would play Sun Song, but whatever. Oh, I never get the sword, sword thing. All right, let's see if frogs are really always loaded. Uh, for go mode, I need some combination of hammer, mirror shield, uh, shadow bosky, and fire bosky. Ocarina, thank you. Frogs have the ocarina. Do they have any other items? Ocarina locked ocarina, yeah. Love to see it. Gotta love no logic. Yeah, cows can have items. In fact, I will be getting some cows soon. Looking for hammer, mirror shield, fire boss key, uh, shadow boss key. No, not a baby seed. Early on, the seed was actually pretty rough. <clears throat> it's not like rough right now, but it's been a while since I got an important item, minus ocarina. I'm at the phase where like, I can do whatever I want. I just need to actually get the, get the items that don't necessarily, well, there's mirror shield. That don't necessarily open up a lot of checks, but I just need to finish. So the thing is, I don't know where Twinrova is right now. I know Twinrova has to be either Fire Boss or Shadow Boss, and I don't have either of the boss keys. So actually right now, Mirror Shield doesn't do anything. But as soon as I get one of those boss keys, it will. Well, it might. <clears throat> and I know one of those bosses, those bosses, Fire Boss and Shadow Boss, I know are um, Twinrova and Bongo. I just don't know which one's which. <clears throat> yeah, I have boss rooms randomized now. Both ocarinas were ocarina locked. <laughs> nice. All right, so I know Shadow is bomb of the well, so I'm gonna have to QPA this. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Gold scale. Song of time. 
We got all the songs, or not all the songs, Missing Requiem. Nice, I'm surprised that hit. Oh, there's lighter. Good thing I came back over here. Requiem, that's good. Uh, your heat timer is based on your um, number of hearts. It's um, eight seconds per full heart or there's hammer. It's eight seconds per, per full heart or uh, two seconds per quarter heart or one second per eighth of a heart. Um, okay, I'm gonna set Fora's Wind here. Uh, so Volvagia is Spirit Temple. Okay, and I just got Requiem, so... So I mean, I'm kind of in go mode. I am in go mode if I decide to do Spirit Temple Child Spirit climb, like climb up Spirit Temple as child. Uh, the issue is I'm just not sure how to go about it. I think my plan is I'm gonna go to Spirit Temple as adult and I'm gonna lower the mirror and I'm gonna lower the mirror and then I'm gonna have child hover from the mirror to the head. Why is OT so famous for speedruns but Majora's Mask not really? Well, Majora's Mask does get quite a bit of attention for speedruns. Uh, it is true that it's not as much as OOT, but, um, okay, so now I'm gonna go Child. Uh, well, one, OOT is just generally more popular than MM, and people who've played one have usually played the other, and OOT is usually just easier to get into because there's a bigger community, so it's kind of like rich, rich get richer for OOT. But then also, MM has the first cycle issue where the first 20 minutes of the run are really boring. And that turns a lot of people off. MM is still definitely fairly popular. But, um... In cases where, like, there's one more popular game and another similar game, like, sequel, but is always in the shadow of the other game, it's always kind of going to be like that. Oh, wait. Uh... I have a problem I didn't think about. Child can definitely... Can Child triple slash clip here? I don't even have... The sword. Uh, I'm sure there is a way to do this. Uh, there is something else I can do. You can hover out of bounds out of that uh, angle in the in the ceiling and hover all the way around, which is pretty dumb. Uh, I could go through Requiem. I can go through the hands, but that's really bad. It might be best for me to search for Din's or Shadow Boss Key. I'm gonna go Adult. I forgot that randomized bosses would lead to situations where I might need to do a child dungeon as adult, or adult dungeon as child to get to the boss room. Yeah, this is my la this is gonna be my, my longest rando over the last few days, but it's partially because of the extended settings. I increased the settings a bit. Was that a spirit key? Well, even if it is a spirit key, I still, the whole child spirit thing I have to do, again, I'm still like not sure I even know what I need to do for sure. Okay, yeah, so I can go try it, but I, I'm, I think it's better for me to check the rest of fire and see if I find Din's or Shadow Key here. Can I get the snipe? Nice. Okay, I'll go back to child. I'll try Child Spirit. Of all the dungeon boss combinations, it had to be Spirit Temple having Baronade. What's missing for Gomo? Technically nothing, but I have to do something dumb. Okay, that should be good. Uh... Okay, I was worried about the chain pushing me off. Okay, so this is the scary part because there's slippery slopes down there. Uh, I'm not really sure how I need to do this hover. So I'm kind of just gonna go at it like this. Oh no, that's really bad. Um, cool. Seriously? This is why I say with Furrow's Wind. Oh, there is head clip as child? Okay, I have no idea how precise any of that is. I don't know if that's a good idea for me to just try right now. Yeah, I think this is... I think I should stick with this for now. It's fine.
Nice. Hacker voice, I'm in. I had to do this as child because I can't equip um, Boomerang as adult. I don't have... The only way to equip swap Boomerang as adult is with Din's Fire in Rando. And I do not have Din's Fire. Uh, the reason you need Din's Fire to equip swap is uh, in Rando they change the pause screen so that the cursor can move over any slot even if you don't have an item. And this is because in vanilla OOT, um, if you get items in a certain order or if your pause screen has a certain layout, it's actually impossible to move the cursor to certain item slots. And so Rando's fix for that, since you know you could have basically any item screen layout, is to make sure that the item cursor can move to any slot. The side effect of the cursor moving to any slot is that when you're moving the cursor from either side of the screen, um, the cursor will always move to the top the top row of the closest column that's filled with items. What that essentially means is that if you have anything in the first column on either side of the pause screen, then the cursor will always move to the top slot, which is either Deku Sticks or Din's Fire. And if the cursor always moves to the top slot, then you have to have either Deku Sticks or Din's Fire available to equip in order to equip swap. Adult cannot equip Deku Sticks normally, so that rules that out. And so in vanilla, um, all you need is the first item that the cursor moves to normally to be equipable. And in vanilla, that can be anything that is closest um, to that side of the pause screen. So like in vanilla, if I had Feroz Wind or Neighbor's Love, those would work. Or if I had a completely empty right column, but I had like fire arrows, then I could eco swap with fire arrows or something. Rate the seed out of 10. It was an interesting seed. I don't know what to rate it. Maybe 7.5. Solid. Interesting. Unique. Maybe, maybe 7.9. Dude, that timing was perfect. Okay. Cool. Okay, so these settings did seem to add a lot of time. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how much time was added just from from the boss randomization and the extra boss key, or if it was just a bad seed. But I'll do I'll do a few with these settings and see like how it averages out. Okay, let's do spoiler log. Din's fire was Shadow Temple Invisible Floor Master Chest. Okay, so if I checked Din's wait. Dude, okay, that kind of sucks because I was, um, I told myself I wasn't going to check Shadow past the boat until I get the Shadow boss key because then I'd have to take the boat twice. So I thought, okay, it's not really worth checking down there. But that had Din's fire. <laughs> so that's cool. Uh, let me see. What about Shadow boss key? Colossus GS bean patch. I'm dumb, dude. I meant to get Colossus GS bean patch before my last long child section and I just forgot about it. I mean, I couldn't have gotten that until I got Requiem, which- actually, wait, did I get Requiem on my last- Did I get Requiem after my last long child section? Last long child section being, like, before I just went child just to go to spirit. I forgot. I forgot exactly how things played out. I got Requiem before doing fire. Yeah, yeah, then after fire, I just went straight for the bosses, and then after I beat Volvagia, then I just went straight for beating. Okay, yeah, so I never actually- I mean, I should have checked- the bean patch on my way to child spirit when I was like, you know, going to child spirit to actually do it. But, um, yeah, whatever. So that was an interesting seed. I think I played that seed mostly pretty well, considering it was actually tricky early on. But I think I'm, I'm happy with that seed. But yeah, anyway, um, thanks for watching, guys. Probably done for now. Gonna find someone to raid.